So you might be in a situation where for some reason iOS 18.7.1 is just not installing or it's not basically installing properly. Now, this can happen for a couple of different reasons. Number one, the very first thing I recommend doing here is to go through and make sure you're connected to a good internet connection and a Wi-Fi connection. Sometimes your data connection, your Wi-Fi connection can have a problem. So go through, make sure you're connected to a good Wi-Fi connection, a good data connection, and that'd be an easy way to fix this type of issue. Now, if that's not working, and the next thing I recommend doing is opening up your settings application of your iPhone. So open up settings. And what you want to do is click on the general option right here. And then you want to click on iPhone storage. So what you want to do is make sure you have enough storage saved on your iPhone to where the update can download and install. Sometimes you might not have enough of an update or enough of, you know, a way of having enough storage on your device to install it. So go through, make sure you have enough storage, make sure you have enough information stored there. That can be another really easy way to fix this problem. If that's not working, you can try restarting your iPhone. So hold down the buttons you normally would use to restart your device and go ahead, slide a power off, right? Turn off your phone and you want to see if that ends up fixing the problem. If that still doesn't do it, you might want to go through and try refollowing these steps in this video because that might end up fixing the problem for you. So those are kind of the main ways to go and fix it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, well then.